One evening, as the sun dipped below the horizon, Tim heard a faint rustling outside his cabin. The sound was not unfamiliar to him, it was common for creatures of the wild to wander close to human habitation. Curiosity peaked, he cautiously stepped outside and was surprised to find a bobcat kitten sitting on his porch, its eyes wide with innocence. With a gentle smile, Tim placed a bowl of food and water for the little visitor before quietly retiring for the night. The next morning, a strange noise roused Tim from his slumber. He stepped outside, expecting to see the lone bobcat once again. But this time, his heart skipped a beat as he found an entire family of bobcats gathered on his porch. Their piercing eyes stared at him, and he could sense a mix of caution and curiosity in their gaze. While Tim marveled at the sight before him, he couldn't help but notice that among the bobcats, there was an unfamiliar face, a young Canadian lynx kitten, evidently lost and out of place. Unlike its bobcat companions, this lynx showed no fear of humans and even seemed comfortable with their presence. It approached Tim without hesitation, and he couldn't help but feel a deep connection with the vulnerable creature. Over the next few days, Tim observed the bobcat family's routine. As he left food for them each evening, they would cautiously venture to his porch, keeping a safe distance while enjoying the offerings. Among them, the young Canadian lynx became a regular visitor, seemingly seeking comfort and companionship from the gentle human. Word of the extraordinary visitors quickly spread through the small community nearby. Neighbors were both fascinated and concerned, urging Tim to offer more food to attract the bobcats again. Yet, despite the allure of such an enchanting encounter, Tim knew he had to be cautious. He was well aware of the dangers of encouraging wild predators to associate humans with a readily available food source. With a heavy heart, Tim chose to resist the temptation of luring the bobcats back to his porch. Instead, he focused on keeping a safe distance, maintaining the boundary between wild and civilized, and cherishing the memory of that magical encounter.